Johan van Seyl, Cape Town, South Africa. I did my first August when I was nine with my mom. And, and from there on, it just got more and more. And I also started training more, racing more. I got some results at under 10 SAs, under 12. So that just made me want to race my bike more, train harder and yeah. I started watching some of the racing on TV and I saw, okay, but that's where I want to go. That's what I want to do. I've been basing myself in Spain for the past three years. So then I missed the August because I went to Spain. With the racing in Europe, then I think like the maximum riders you get at the start is up to 200, where at the August you get up to 35,000. And it's from young to old, everyone wants to ride the August and just, yeah. So you, you can't imagine how big the August actually is. Uh, going over to Europe, it was fun and I like doing it. So it wasn't a big step to do it. And I think I've been lucky because I've been in the right group of riders. There were, I think, up to 50 really strong juniors. So it made us have to step up a level to be able to actually be good. So that I'm lucky with that. Being able to race with your home country team, with your friends, and being able to communicate with all of the staff, it's just, I mean, I can't think of a better team um, out there. Um, it's really comfortable to be, uh, for example, at the dinner table because we can all understand each other where in Spain, I can speak Spanish, but there's still a little bit of a barrier. I mean, I can only speak that much. Up to now, I haven't really been doing big, big races. I just did some league races in Spain and some tours over there. So it's still going to be a really big step uh, to be in Europe and to race pro races. But I'm so motivated and I can't wait to, uh, to take that step. To win a stage at the Tour de France must be the ultimate. Even if you can win the prologue and have the yellow jerseys for, for a while, I think with my riding style, I won't be up there for the GC. So I have to look for some opportunities in breakaways and maybe one day I have a lucky break and, and, and then win a stage in the Tour de France. That would really be a dream come true. I went to my first bike hand out and just seeing all of those kids after they received their bikes, um, smiling, and racing their bikes as, as fast as, as possible and just having a small part of the feeling that I get when I race my bike, it's just really motivating to see them also happy on a bicycle as I am. Johan van Seyl is, is also one of the best under 23 riders in South Africa, different rider to, to Louis. He's a, he's a guy that can go up the road, make the racing really, really hard, also a really good time trialist. Um, he's been national road and under 23 time trial road and, and uh, time trial under 23 champion so look forward to to some really big results from him and I think he'll be focusing a lot on the on the one day races this coming year and uh, you know I think a guy that will build into one of the better riders in the next two to three years.